Hey, hey, happy Monday or whatever day it is that you're watching this. Um, this week is going to be more of a get it all done with me. Um, I have a lot of cleaning to do. I still have to meal plan for this week, which is irritating because today is Monday and I have no idea what we're going to eat for dinner. I don't even think we have meat out. I think we have bacon. So I might end up doing breakfast tonight for dinner. Um, but I definitely have some cleaning that I need to get done. Um, I did upload this week's video this morning. So if you haven't seen it, check back. I know whenever you're watching this one, it's like been a week since that one. But anyway, check that one out. It was a week in the life of my birthday week. Um, so now as a result, I did not do a lot of cleaning. I let my um, RoboVac do all the vacuuming around the house. Um, the only thing I think we kept up with was laundry and making our beds and dishes. That's pretty much about it. Um, so now I have a lot of like, I gotta clean the bathrooms, I gotta mop the floors, I gotta really vacuum all our floors, not just let the RoboVac do it all. Um, it's Monday, Mondays are my laundry days, Mondays and Thursdays I do laundry. Um, so I do have some loads of laundry to do. Um, so we'll do that today. This will probably be over a course of a few days. So if I'm like, hi, it's now Tuesday, it's the next day. Um, that's because, well, it's a week um, worth of cleaning. But grab your brooms, your mops, your rags, your multi-purpose cleaner, and let's just get cleaning. I probably won't hop on here and talk a lot unless I'm sharing like some specialty project our product that I'm using. Um, but I really don't use a lot of specialty products. Um, probably the typical cleaners that you use. Um, so let's do it. Let's get it done. Just put me on your TV and let's just get to clean it. Hours from dawn as I'm driving at night waiting to get somewhere what can go wrong when we say it out right i really wish you were here people seem to know just where they're heading while you and i just feel like we're pretending can't do it on my own When I'm this far away from home Won't you tell me something good Won't you tell me something good As I think of you and I There's too much gonna pass us by If we don't talk like we should Won't you tell me something good Weekend is gone To know just where they're heading While you and I just feel like we're pretending I can't do it on my own When I'm this far away from home Won't you tell me something good Won't you tell me something good From home, won't you tell me something good? Won't you tell me something good? As I think of you and I, there's too much gonna pass us by if we don't talk like we should. Won't you tell me something good? I can't do it on my own when I'm this far away from home. Won't you tell me something good? Something good Won't you tell me something good 
Um, I did want to hop on here real quick and just show you how my closet's holding up. It's been like two weeks since I've done this. Um, it still looks about the same. I did have to add these photos up here, um, these frames. They are, um, that front one is actually of my husband and I's engagement and behind that is a wedding gift that we had received and I just don't know where to put it but I am too sentimental I guess to get rid of it. But I did end up having to purchase um, 10 more of those bins. I kind of am frustrated with myself for not going and buying them right away but you'll notice that they are white instead of the gray. Um, these gray ones because they came in the pack they went really fast. Um, especially because they ended up going down to like 640, um, which is fantastic instead of the original $8. Um, but other than that, um, this side here remains the same pretty much. I did add backup, um, oh my goodness, what is that called? Backup toilet paper. And then I did buy a new box. This is from Target. I'll link it below. It is the Bright Room. It is, it's like a $10 little bin. Um, again, this is just holding our sheets, which I cannot get this open. Anyway, whatever. Just trust me. <laughs> it's holding our sheets. Um, but yeah, overall, the closet is still looking really good. If I can get it to focus, there we go. It's still looking really good. Um, the baskets here, I did add a basket down here because I do, um, hand wash a lot of my dresses required to be hand washed so I like to separate those so this is another one of those bright room um, felt baskets it's just square I can move some clothes out of the way um, it has some stuff that I wore over the weekend but um, yeah it's really really nice it's a good size I do not remember how much I paid for it but I will link it below um, just a little bit ago I showed those um, labels that I got at Target I'm gonna put them on these bins here um, because that way I know which one's my skirts and which one is my sweatshirts because I noticed that when I go to grab a sweatshirt, I always pull down the wrong bin. Um, so I am going to label those. Um, so maybe I'll share those that in this, um, video as well. And then one last change that I did, um, I did add in my boots and I just did the pool noodle trick. I bought a pool noodle at Dollar Tree and just cut it in half and stuffed it in there. That way they stand up really nicely. Um, but there it is. It's looking pretty good. It's holding up pretty well. Um, I really like it. I still like this method. Um, I highly suggest it if you are a shoe box, like the original box that they come in hoarder like I was. I highly suggest this. It is an investment, but I just love it. I think it looks better. Um, like I said last time, whenever I did it and I was showcasing the closet, I just think it looks better. And I love that I can see what shoe is in it, especially if you have like um a brand a specific brand you know we all do like i have three pairs of burks up there like it's ridiculous but the box is all the same so now i know which ones are which and all of that so um that's it i just wanted to share that and what this the closet looked like and how it's still holding up so that's it let's get back to cleaning though <laughs> stars come to shine when it's dark from so far away show us where we are what makes the sun go to sleep every night and what's it dreaming of i wonder Sky sometimes hides behind the clouds Maybe it's just like me A little bit scared of heights Why does the rain always keep on pouring down When it's gray outside It really makes me wonder Could it be to make the ground 
shine like gold until winter comes. Until winter comes. Until winter comes. It really makes me wonder.
we wake Hear the birds and see the sun Side by side our fears are done Oh the good times just begun We know what we have, let's hold on tight Found what we're looking for in life Call us crazy, but things are finally right With you and I, the future is bright oh, You and I, we got it
Okay, so here is how I meal plan. I have this planner. It's literally the best planner ever. It's the Daily Planner by Sue Hooley. I highly suggest it. Um, it's the homemaker's friend. Um, I, I found it this year and I just love it. It's got tabs for the year, the month, and the week. And then over here it has like your tasks, your projects, your info, and a shopping list. Um, but this is it. This is how I meal plan because it has like a little menu location. I'm keeping track of video. It's cool because it has a cute little, or not a cute verse, a nice little verse to go with it for the week. Um, and then you can write your intentional cheer for the week as well. Um, this week's verse is, Behold, I am the Lord, the God of all flesh. Is there anything too hard for me? Jeremiah 32, 27. Um, and then just on the calendar, it shows like what week you're on. Um, obviously today is Monday the 15th. I am recording my video for next week, which I was originally going to do tomorrow, but it just worked out to do it, um, today. Um, tonight we're just going to have breakfast. Like I mentioned, um, I did not take any meat out. I did not prep plan or anything for <laughs> dinner tonight. So, but we do have bacon. So I'm just going to make up some eggs, um, and bacon toast and all that kind of stuff tomorrow. We're just going to have a really easy, it's really quick. It's a Buffalo chicken and rice skillet. Um, it's really, really good. Uh, maybe if I think about it, I may, maybe I'll share it, but if anything, I'll put the link for it down below. Um, Wednesday, my husband um, requested Sloppy Joes. I make them really easy. I do turkey meat and I make my own sauce because I just think it tastes better. Um, Thursday, I believe we have country ribs in our deep freezer. Um, so I'm gonna make those up, do mashed potatoes and just cook up a vegetable, no big deal. Friday, I have plans to go out with a friend and get some pedicures. Um, so the boys are just going to have pizza or go to my in-laws house. Um, they do that a lot whenever I'm out and about. Um, Saturday, this is just a staple. I always put tuna melts or we'll just take, you know, really any deli meat and cook up a sandwich, whatever. Um, and then Sunday for the crock pot meal, it's just going to be, uh, case of chicken tacos, which is also really delicious. I'll put that recipe down below. Um, but that's really it. Uh, the next thing I do is just make my um, grocery list and then decide if I want to order groceries or go buy groceries. And if I want to do that tonight or if I want to do it tomorrow. I know that my parents will be here tomorrow, but I also have a call, an important call tomorrow at 2.30. So um, anyway, let's make up this grocery list. Night, cause I promise you Um, it's now Friday. It's been a week. I think it's been a week of Mondays to be fully honest with you. Um, the boys are out spending some time together. I have to finish up at least the rest of my house. Um, I mean, to be honest, I've had to refresh the house throughout the week, but today I'm going to focus in on the kitchen. I need to make my bed still. It's like three o'clock in the afternoon. I've had quite the Friday. I just got off work. And if you remember from my week in the life, I work a six to two, so I had a solid like hour after work. Um, actually, I think it's like 3.30 now. I worked a little after three. Anyway, I've gotta get the kitchen cleaned up. I've gotta make my bed, fold up a load of laundry that I washed up yesterday. Um, I just, I really wanna finish this up for you guys. Let you see a little snippet of what I cleaned throughout 
what I would normally do in a day, but didn't because like I said, it's been a week. Anyway, let's finish up, grab your dish rags, let's wash some dishes, enjoy the fine tunes that I pick, um, and then we'll finish out this video and finish out this week. About to leave, already packing, come with me, I'm not really asking. Get away to a place where we don't know About to see the world in action What we can be like with no distractions We'll get away, this is what we waited for Take my hand, we'll make it somehow Dream 
the wind could spread your love? What if your sweetness could reach everyone? There'd be no wars. everybody thank you so much for coming along with me and cleaning my house along with me i hope you got something accomplished today too um join me again next week i don't know what we've got planned i'm sure it's gonna be something fun but thanks so much for coming along on this journey with me for making this dream a reality you are so important to me you are loved and i just can't wait to see where this journey takes us see you next week bye guys